Ooh, nice cool morning out today. Oh, it's about 5.40. Getting ready to head to the office. Get ready to go train. Holly, get her kicking ass for today. Oh, man. That was a little rough, getting up early. But I should have got to bed sooner, so. No excuses. Can't blame nobody but myself. Let's get rocking. All right, we're all done. We're we'll after seven o'clock now. Kicked ass, had a good workout. Probably got arms on fire today, but uh, it's gonna tell to head home. See what kind of trouble I can get into. And you know, I know I know I to get my hair cut. Got to make some phone calls. Got to wait on a phone call. Stuff to do. It's nice and cool out, so maybe I can get some stuff done outside in the shop while it's nice. Like it. I like this getting up early. I like it a lot. Well, today was going good. <sighs> Till about a half hour ago, the uh, adjuster called me. Everything's great, smooth, and heck, they weren't even going to call it. They weren't. They don't even have anybody to send out, especially for boats. So they just either tell you to take it to a shop or a person, whoever you're gonna have do it and get the estimate, you know, on all the parts, you know, get the whole itemized list together. And then at the very, I was like, cool. Well, gave him the dude's number because he took pictures, you know, and what all he needs and stuff like that. And at the very end, he's like, hey, uh, your deductibles, uh, 5,000, you know, right? I'm like, shit. He's like, keep my deductibles around 1,000. So what we know is that it's, it would be a stretch to make even the full parts list over 6,000. So it's not even worth it for insurance. So we can get it done for probably less than two grand. So call the insurance dude back, cancel that. And I even called my insurance company like, hey, what would it be if you know I put my deductible around a thousand? He said, uh, your insurance would go up from 200 bucks a year to like 312 bucks a year that go up a hundred bucks a year. So I would have double checked that and done that. Yeah, I could have paid a thousand bucks and had, you know, everything fixed and done. But now, you gotta spend more. So, lesson, double check stuff. I, I usually always call my insurance to keep up on it, but nothing's ever happened with the boat. Nothing's ever went wrong. Should have kept up on it. Should have double checked. Should have done that, so yeah. Ain't no point in when something's gonna cost me five grand, you know, in full parts, is to pay a deductible of five grand and have your insurance go up. So, yeah, we can get remanufactured just as good parts for 2,000 or less. So, yeah, I kind of forgot everything else I did today and not what to talk about because that's really got me frustrated. And of course, where he needs all the serial numbers for the engine, transom, stuff like that. They were supposed to be on top of the flame arrestor, the air intake. They're not there. So now I have to crawl around and find the serial numbers off the engine block, the transom. So phone's about to die, so I'm charging it real quick. Decided to do this before I head back out there and find those numbers. Oh, happy days. That's what I get. Plan and prep. Always step on all your shit. The one thing that I really thought about, and it's the one thing that you don't think about, we're gonna bite you in the ass. So, lesson learned. Learn from my mistakes. Oh, it's about time for bed. Ugh. Today has just been a, a day. More, oh, decent news, not good news. My own mistakes, my own faults, whatever. You know, it's just the way life goes. But I always stay vigilant and stay up on, you know, what you need to know, what you need to do, how you need to grow. Like, that's it. Pay attention to everything that's in your life. Like, you know, if something happens, that's what uh, things will ever catch you for. But if you don't have things set in place, then they can't catch you. Other than that, you know, I just thought about it after today. Everything just kind of had me down and out and just upset and upset with myself and anything. But what's the point? It already happened. I already made the 
decision back when it already happened now like it's too late what am I gonna get down and upset and mad about like there's nothing I can't there's no reason to be upset and mad or anything else like it is what it is you can't dwell on it we make bad decisions sometimes we take shortcuts but as in today like that shortcut you know turn around to bite me in the ass especially with the uh, boat and the insurance like I the deductible I did not even think about that because it's out of all of my vehicles but it's just five eight eight things or something like that that I have insured like should have went and double checked on everything that's why I used to do often but I didn't I haven't done anything with the boat in so long because nothing's happened in four years so hey would it cost me an extra hundred dollars a year to lower my deductible by four thousand <laughs> you know and this is the thing you know like you guys see the ups, the downs, the hurdles, the problems, the things that just hit me in my face and knock me on my ass. Like, you guys see it all, and I show you guys everything, but I just show you, like, I can't do anything about it now. Like, what happens? It is what it is. Like, it's a nature of the beast. It's part of having toys. Like, that's why, you know, you have savings built up and you have, you know, slush funds and stuff like that. It's just, what can you do? Like, you just got to stay positive through it all. TBS, you know, think, be, stay positive. You have to do it in every single day in every way. And this is the harder times, you know. Every single day in every way. Like, this is one of the ways I got to stay positive. Like, I made my decision. I made my decision back when. I made my decision to get a boat. I made that, you know. Stuff breaks down just like any of my other toys. So, you got to deal with it. Move on with life. Continue going and growing can't let one little hiccup you know hurl you and get you down so you know but it took me some time you know today being frustrated with myself and aggravated like I'm human just like anybody else it happens but at the end of the day when you stop and think about everything it's just minuscule in the whole grand scheme of life or let alone vehicles or toys or breakdowns and stuff that I have like it's tiny so many of your issues are tiny in the huge grand scheme of life. So you need to have it affect a tiny part of your day, a tiny part of your attitude, a tiny part of your demeanor, but get back up, kick ass, take names. So you're gonna kick ass, go to bed. It's like 12, flow after 12. Tomorrow's a new day. Forward progress is the only thing that matters.